Welcome back guys to my Red Dead Redemption 2 news series. In this episode we're going to be talking about the exclusive treasure map, how you can get your hands on it. We're also going to be talking about an upcoming exclusive weapon to the game, the Tomahawk, and what you actually need to do to get this. And also an indication of when we can finally expect some gameplay. Now first of all, let's talk about the treasure map. Now the pre-order bonus to get this treasure map has actually been extended a couple more weeks to August 15th. So you guys have basically a couple more weeks from when I'm recording this video to decide if you want to pre-order within that time, if you haven't already, and get yourself the exclusive treasure map. Unfortunately, this is only a digital pre-order bonus, so if any of you guys have pre-ordered physical copies of Red Dead Redemption 2, you won't be getting this map. Now, it's quite hard at this stage to determine how important this treasure map will be. I don't think the secret buried treasure is exclusive to the pre-order bonus, but the map, however, is. It's simply said when it was announced that the map will give Arthur a head start on the hunt for hidden riches. So it sounds like we'll still be able to get the treasure, we might just have to do a little more work to get our hands on it. The other digital pre-order bonus was a cash bonus for Red Dead Redemption 2 story mode. Again, it doesn't say how much money we're actually going to be making. It says here that the in-game cash bonus will give Arthur Morgan enough to buy a weapon, some food, some useful items and ammunition. So these don't sound like huge pre-order bonuses, so I really don't think we'll be missing out on these if we don't get the digital pre-order. So I kind of made the personal decision that I would rather get a physical copy of the game rather than getting a digital pre-order bonus, just because I personally like having physical copies of games. The next bit of news was a very brief sentence mentioned by Rockstar on their newswire, and it was actually included in a GTA Online After Hours post, and it says a lost relic resurfaces. The return of a lost relic from the old frontier is on the horizon. Keep a lookout for the first clue to unlocking this unique totem later this week. Now this has actually already been leaked, this totem is a tomahawk weapon that's going to be unlocked through a treasure hunt in GTA Online. It's going to be quite similar to the Golden Revolver treasure hunt where you have to follow some clues in the game, find yourself the weapon, and this will not only unlock the weapon in GTA Online, but it will also give you the weapon in Red Dead Redemption 2. So it's definitely worth playing through the treasure hunt when it's released and getting this weapon. I'm pretty happy to see Rockstar are doing more treasure hunts because personally I think they're really fun and it's a nice little cross promotion between Red Dead Redemption 2 and GTA Online. The Tomahawk isn't actually released in the game yet but I will have a guide up for you guys explaining exactly what you need to do to find it when it has been released. The last thing I wanted to mention in this video is when we can actually expect to see some Red Dead Redemption 2 gameplay. Now there are some people speculating that the reason the pre-order bonus for the treasure map has been extended is to give people a chance to see some gameplay before the, the pre-order bonus is over. Usually games do release some gameplay during a pre-order bonus so people can actually see what the game looks like before they decide to pre-order. Now although this is complete speculation from the community, I'd say there is a pretty good chance that we will get some gameplay within the next few weeks. I think there are a lot of people waiting to pre-order um, just to see what the gameplay looks like. Is this game going to look as great as it's been cracked up to be so far? So that's all the Red Dead Redemption 2 news I've got for you guys today. Let me know down in the comments if you guys care about the, the exclusive treasure map. Are you guys going to be digitally pre-ordering the game just to get this map? Or are you going to maybe hold off and wait and see some gameplay before you decide to pre-order? If you are new to my channel, be sure to subscribe. I'll keep you guys up to date with all of the latest news and updates for this game. And I'll see you guys in the next one.